I'm so excited. I'm here at the Manor House Granite Factory. And this is the first time I've ever been in a granite factory. I'm here with Jeff. And this is the process where a customer has already picked out what they would like. And now they have to pick out their specific piece of granite. Yes, yeah, so our customers will then come down to our granite factory and they'll mm -hmm. select the stone, usually with Jamie and Danny. And you can see that we're going to pull out this 1,100 pound piece of granite. And you can physically see all the characteristics of it. From there, we'll go ahead and cut it. It's beautiful. No doubt. What step in the process is this? Right now, Dan is digitizing a template that we made at a customer's home. This will be an exact replica of their countertop. We're going to send this over to our CNC. It'll cut it out perfectly. Oh, so this is the shape of someone's countertop at home. This is actually their island top. Wow, this is pretty cool. All right, Mikey, today I'm going to have you cut a piece of granite. These large slabs are loaded onto one of our gantry saws using diamond tip blades and lots of water. We can cut this slab. Here you we, go. Oh, we have goggles. <laughs> I'm ready to go. And this will start the machine. One, two, three, simple enough. All right, Jeff, this machine is huge. It looks like a robot. This what is, is a uh, CNC machine, and Terry is going to pull some shaping tooling out. It'll come back over and begin to shape this piece of granite. This piece of granite is held down to this table by suction cups so it doesn't move during this process. Mm -hmm. Finger bits and shaping bits will drop down and shape this piece of stone to exactly what Dan earlier programmed into the digitizer. Perfect. So first we, we picked it, we cut it, and now we're shaping it. You got it. Seth is operating our straight polishing machine. What this machine does is use five series of polishing pads to achieve the same sheen that's on the face of the granite. We use this machine to do pieces that aren't required to go to the CNC to be shaped, just straight pieces. It does a beautiful job for us. Okay, it looks like we have some more polishing happening here. Yeah, Mike is one of our lead polishers here at the Granite Factory. He's been doing this for about 17 years and his skills really show it. We do an extra step here at the Granite Factory. After the pieces come off the machines, we take them here for a final inspection, make sure we touch everything up to get it as perfect as a stone can be. Yeah, he looks like he's doing a great job. No doubt. Mike's excellent at this. Yes, I noticed that every machine that we looked at today used water. About 100 gallons a minute we use during peak fabrication. Mm -hmm. This press allows us to clean 100 gallons of fresh water every minute. So we keep the process green, just like granite. Nice green material comes out of the earth. I love how green it is. <laughs> All right, Jeff, well, I feel like I've learned a lot here today. Great. And uh, we'll send it back to the studio. Thank you. It's interesting to see everything that goes into right. it before it comes into your kitchen. And who knows, Mikey might have even cut your granite. Your granite at home. Yeah. And we're loving our kitchen, thanks to Manor House, and thanks to them for showing us all the great stuff that they do at their granite factory in Gr Greensburg and what they do for their customers every day. It was a really neat process to see. Yeah, very cool. Behind the scenes there. <laughs>